Grade 5, Module 6, Lesson 15, Homework. Number 1, circle the pairs of segments that are perpendicular. Remember, perpendicular means that it has a 90 degree angle or a right angle. So you can find if something has a 90 degree or a right angle by using a set square tool, which basically just means anything that has a 90 degree angle. For example, the corner of a piece of paper. Or I'm going to use the corner of my ruler because it's a 90 degree angle. So just find anything around your house that has a 90 degree angle and put it inside of the angle there and make sure that that angle is a 90 degree angle as well. So this first one here, that is a 90 degree angle because I put my ruler up to it. This one right below, this angle is not a 90 degree angle. So a 90 degree angle would be more like this where it would have to be 90 degrees, but this stops right there, so that's not. The next one, all right here, this one is not a 90 degree angle. This one right here actually has four 90 degree angles, so they are perpendicular. Uh, this is a 90 degree angle, so those lines are perpendicular. Here, that's a 90 degree angle. So that's perpendicular. And the last one, that is not a 90 degree angle, so that doesn't work. And I just realized I accidentally circled this one, but that wasn't a 90 degree angle, so not that one. Number two, in the space below, use your right triangle templates to draw at least three different sets of perpendicular lines. So maybe you're like me and don't have a right triangle template. So use like what we just talked about, like the corner of a piece of paper or your ruler. I'm just going to set my ruler down and draw a line on one side and the other, and then connect them. So there's one pair. And I'm just going to do that three different times. So draw another corner. And I'll connect them. And one more. So there are my three different sets of perpendicular lines. You could have crossed them, uh, kind of like um, this one. You could have done that where they completely intersect, but I just drew uh, 90 degree angles. Number three, draw a segment perpendicular to each given segment. Show your thinking by sketching triangles as needed. So what I'm going to do is just set my ruler or you could your piece of paper, whatever you're using. I'm going to put it right up against that line. And then on the other side, I'm just going to draw a line. If you want to go ahead and connect it and make a triangle, you can do that too. So I'm going to do that for all of them. I'm just going to set my ruler against the line that's already drawn and then draw another line. in a very straight line. Let me just see if I can fix it a little bit. Again, if it helps you and you want to connect it and make a triangle, making right triangles, you can do that too. You don't need to. Number four, draw two different lines perpendicular to line B. So we're going to draw two lines that are perpendicular to line B. So I'm just going to put my ruler up against line B. And I'm just going to draw two lines on either side. 
of my ruler. So there's one. Then I'm going to use the other side of my ruler. Oops. And draw another line. And there it is. If you want to totally intersect them or cross them, you can do that too. And there you have it.